Hello Sagittarius. So today we're going to be doing your general love reading for the month of March 2021. And please keep in mind this reading it may or may not resonate with each of one of you. So take what resonates with you for the rest. Okay. So let's see what's going on, my Sagittarius. I hope you all are doing well for yourself, taking care of yourself. And I hope God continues to bless my Sagittarius. Okay, so let's see what's going on with my Sagittarius. Spirit, please give me the energy surrounding my Sagittarius. Okay. What's the energy? Oh, man, it fell, y'all. We're not going to take that because... I don't think spirit wanted me to take that, y'all. <laughs> so let's shuffle again. What's going on my Sagittarius at the moment? What's the energy surrounding my Sagittarius? Sorry, my friend texted me, y'all. <laughs> okay. going on my Sagittarius okay so at the bottom of the deck we have the king of pentacles so I feel like the person that you're dealing with they view you very highly Sag and they really admire and respect you and I definitely feel like this person they think that you're attractive Okay, whether it's male or female, this person, they think that you're attractive. They think that you got it all for yourself. You're independent. You don't need nobody. You got money. Okay. And this person, they really um, admire you. What I'm feeling like. Okay. And it's so funny because we have the queen of pentacles here. So I definitely feel like Sag, the person that you're dealing with, right? Now, this could be your husband. Your, your wife, your boyfriend, your girlfriend, whoever it is that you're dealing with, okay? This person, they feel like you're very attractive, okay? And I feel like it's because you guys are just focusing on yourself. You guys are just taking care of yourself. You guys are, you know, you're looking good. Like, look at this, how pretty this girl is. Like, you're looking good, okay? And I definitely feel like that's the energy that you guys are in right now. You guys are just taking care of yourself, um, taking care of your mental, making sure that you're okay, um, making money. You guys could, you know, have a new job. You guys are making some good money. I definitely feel like a lot of people are attracted to you, Sag. People is like, oh my gosh, can I be like my Sagittarius one day? Like, I want to be like Sag. My Sag is looking good. Like, this Sagittarius that I'm dealing with, they look so good. I want to be like them one day. Like, <laughs> and then we have the Eight of Wands here. So this person, or this could be your energy, Sag, or you could be dealing with another Sagittarius, or this could be this person's energy. So it could be you or this person, because this is Sag energy. This is a fire card, so Aries Leo Sagittarius. Oh, my throat. <laughs> So this person, they definitely want to communicate with you. They want to come in. They want to take action. They want to have a conversation with you, Sag. Or you could want a conversation with this person. But I feel like this person, they really want to come in and they want to have a conversation with you because they seeing you being independent. They seeing you doing good for yourself. And they like, I want to, you know what? I want to come in. I want to talk to my Sagittarius. Okay, I want to talk to my Sagittarius. Now, there could have been a situation where you and this person separated and this person, they're missing you. Okay, like this person, they're missing you and they, they feel it. They feel the separation between you two. And this person's like, mm, I want to come in. I want to talk to my Sag. Like, look how good they look. Like this person, they know that you don't need them. Sag, this person, they know that you don't need them. And this is what this person doesn't like. And this is why they want to come back in because they don't like that you're doing well without them. You're being independent. You're looking good without them. Okay. Then we have the hermit here. Yeah. So this person, they feel the separation that you guys went through. They feel 
um the no communication between you two you guys probably haven't talked in a while like months weeks years but I feel like you and this person, you guys didn't talk for a while. And this person, they want to come in. They want to have a conversation with you because without you, this person is feeling lonely. They feel isolated. They feel alone. You know, they just really need you and they really want to come back in. Okay. And then we have the two of swords here. But this person, they're being very indecisive. They don't know how to come back in. You know, maybe it's their ego that's getting to them. But this person, they're trying to make a decision on how to come back in because right now they don't know how to. What I'm feeling like because at the bot, like at the, yeah, next to the two of swords, we have the tower here. So definitely there was a situation that happened between you and this person, Sag. And this person, they want to come back in, but they're being very indecisive. They're trying to figure out how to come back in. What should I do? How to get back to my Sagittarius, okay? They really want you to accept them is what I'm hearing. They want you to accept them. If they want to come in, they're probably going to apologize to you, and they really want you to accept their apology, okay? But, yeah, this person, they admire you. They see you looking good. They think you're very attractive. You're beautiful. You're handsome, whatever it is. This person, they really think highly of you, Sag. And it's why they want to come back in because they miss you. They don't like that you guys haven't talked in weeks, years, months. They miss you, okay? They're feeling isolated. They're feeling alone. They want to come out of this. They want to come out of this hermit mode, okay? And then we have the death card here. So definitely something ended in this situation. There was something that ended between you and this person, and this person, they want to start brand new. They want a transformation. They want to start brand new, okay? And this is why this person, they don't like to feel lonely. They feel that the separation between you and them. And this is why this person, they want to come back in because they don't like the separation between you two. They definitely want a new beginning. They definitely want to start brand new. They want to start over. They want to come in. And they just want you and them to be back on good terms, Sag. And yeah, yeah. Then we have the Six of Swords here. Yeah, like I said, this talks about, you know, letting go of the past, letting go of negative thoughts, negativity, toxic energy. This person, they just want to let all of that go. They just want to come back in and they just want to take things forward with you. Because why? They have so much love and emotions and feelings for you. Now, you could be dealing with a water sign, a Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Yeah. <laughs> I almost forgot what the border size was. But, um, yeah, this person, they want to come back in. They want to take things to the next level. Okay. And then we have the Empress card here. Yeah, so this person, right, they find you so attractive. With the Queen of Pentacles and the Empress, like, this person, they're admiring you right now. Like, they really find you so attractive. You know, you guys could be a mother, with the empress here um but this person they find you so attractive they think that you're a beautiful mother you're um you're doing so well for yourself you know and this person i feel like they're gonna tell you that too with the eight of wands they want to communicate all of their feelings for you sad because they really find you so attractive and so beautiful okay so let's see what this person want to say to you, Sag. What would this person want to say to my Sagittarius spirit? Oh my God, this person, they're literally like obsessed with you guys. <laughs> what does this person want to tell my Sagittarius spirit? You know, after this separation, after you guys went through something, like a toxic situation, this person... They want to come out of that. Like, they don't have no negative thoughts towards you. Like, this person, they just have so much love for you at this point. And they really find you attractive. So, the first card up we have, I look for you everywhere. This is so funny because Libra just got this card. So, you could be dealing with a Libra. But this person, they looking at you. They looking at your social media. They watching you. You know, they're looking at your pictures. They see you looking good. You know, you could have just posted a picture and this person's like, oh my gosh, look how good my Sagittarius looks. Okay? 
And then we have, I feel you leaving me behind. So this person, they feel that you're not giving them the attention. They feel that you're not paying attention to them. And this is what this person doesn't like, okay? What else does this person want to tell my Sagittarius spirit? Okay, so we have, we both know I am not the one for you. So this person, okay, they have a lot of insecurities going on here because this person, they thinking that you don't need them. Like you better it off without them. You could do better without them. You can get you a better man. You can get you a better girl without them. Like you don't need them at all. And this person, their insecurity, their ego is getting in their way. I feel like, okay. What else does this person want to tell my Sagittarius? We have, I'm happy that it's over. Exactly. Like, you guys must have went through a situation that was so toxic. And this person, they're so happy that it's over. They're happy that you guys were able to move on from it. And they're happy that, you know, you they feel so much love for you right now because this person, they definitely want to get out of this hermit mode. They, they don't want to beef with you anymore. They don't want to argue with you anymore. They just want to leave all of it in the past. Like, let's leave it in 2020. We in a new year, new time. Let's leave it all in the past because right now, I don't want to be in that energy. Like, I just want to show my Sagittarius that I have so much love for them and I want to come back in, okay? <laughs> So that's going to be the end of this reading, Sag. If it resonated with you, please give this a thumbs up and put your situation down in the comment section. I'm very curious about if this resonated with you guys. So if it did, um, please subscribe to my channel, like this video, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next reading. Bye.